Roman mythology is the collection of stories and beliefs of ancient Rome, which were influenced by Greek mythology and other cultures. The Roman gods and goddesses were often associated with planets, natural phenomena, or human activities. They also had complex relationships and genealogies, which formed a family tree. The main source of the Roman family tree is the poet Ovid, who wrote the Metamorphoses, a collection of myths that trace the history of the world from creation to his own time. Ovid's family tree is based on the Greek one, but with some variations and additions. The first generation of gods in Roman mythology consisted of the primordial deities, such as Chaos, Gaia Earth, Uranus Sky, and Tartarus Underworld. They gave birth to the Titans, the second generation of gods, who ruled the world before the Olympians. The most important Titans were Saturn Cronus, the god of time and agriculture, and his wife Opsrea, the goddess of abundance. They had six children, Jupiter Zeus, Juno Hera, Neptune Poseidon, Pluto Hades, Vesta Hestia, and Ceres Demeter. Saturn, fearing that his children would overthrow him, swallowed them as soon as they were born, except for Jupiter, who was hidden by Ops. Jupiter grew up and freed his siblings from Saturn's stomach. He then led a war against the Titans, known as the Titanomachy, and defeated them with the help of the Cyclopes and the Hecatonchires, who were also children of Uranus and Gaia. The Titans were imprisoned in Tartarus, except for some who sided with Jupiter, such as Atlas, who was condemned to hold up the sky, and Prometheus, who gave fire to humans. Jupiter became the king of the gods and the ruler of the sky. He married his sister Juno, the queen of the gods and the goddess of marriage and childbirth. However, he was also notorious for his affairs with other goddesses and mortal women, which often angered Juno. Some of his offspring were Minerva Athena, the goddess of wisdom and war Apollo, the god of the sun and music. Diana Artemis, the goddess of the moon and hunting Mars. Ars, the god of war. Vulcan Hephaestus, the god of fire and metalworking. Mercury Hermes, the god of commerce and messenger of the gods. Bacchus Dionysus, the god of wine and ecstasy. Neptune was the god of the sea and earthquakes. He married Amphitrite, a sea nymph, and had a son named Triton, who was half man and half fish. He also had affairs with other nymphs and mortals, such as Medusa, whom he raped in Minerva's temple and was turned into a monster by the goddess. One of his offspring was Pegasus, the winged horse. Pluto was the god of the underworld and the dead. He abducted Proserpina Persephone, the daughter of Ceres, and made her his wife and queen of the underworld. Ceres, the goddess of agriculture and fertility, was so distraught that she caused a famine on earth. Until Jupiter intervened and arranged a compromise, Proserpina would spend half of the year with Pluto and half with Ceres. Vesta was the goddess of the hearth and the home. She was a virgin goddess who never married or had children. She was worshipped by the Vestal Virgins, a group of priestesses who tended the sacred fire in her temple in Rome. Ceres was the goddess of agriculture and fertility. She was the mother of Proserpina and the sister of Jupiter, Juno, Neptune, Pluto, and Vesta. The third generation of gods in Roman mythology were the children of powerful beings called the Olympians and other gods or regular people. Here are some of them. Venus Aphrodite, goddess of love and beauty. She came to life from sea foam after a god named Uranus was defeated by Saturn. Venus was married to Vulcan, but had many other lovers. She had children like Cupid, 
the god of love, Aeneas, a Roman hero, and Harmonia, the goddess of harmony. Minerva Athena, goddess of wisdom and war. She was born from Jupiter's head after he swallowed her mother, Metis. Minerva never married or had kids. She helped heroes like Hercules, Perseus, and Odysseus and was the patron of Athens, crafts, and strategy. Apollo, god of the sun, music, prophecy, and healing. He was Jupiter and Leto's son, with a twin sister named Diana. Apollo had many loves and was a leader in the arts. He founded the famous Oracle of Delphi, a place for prophecy. Diana Artemis, goddess of the moon, hunting, and childbirth. She was Apollo's twin sister and a virgin goddess. Diana protected wild animals and punished those who offended her. Mars Ars, god of war and violence. He was Jupiter and Juno's son and Venus's lover. Mars was a fierce god associated with war and destruction. Vulcan Hephaestus, god of fire, metalworking, and craftsmanship. He was born to Jupiter and Juno, and he was the only lame Olympian. Vulcan created many powerful artifacts and was the patron of volcanoes and blacksmiths. Mercury Hermes, god of commerce, travel, and communication. He was Jupiter and Maya's son, known as the messenger of the gods. Mercury invented things and was a guide to the underworld. Bacchus Dionysus, god of wine, ecstasy, and theater. He was Jupiter and Semele's son, raised by nymphs and satyrs. Bacchus taught humans the art of making wine and was the patron of theater and drama. Hercules Heracles, hero and demigod. Son of Jupiter and Alcmene, he was a mighty hero known for completing difficult tasks. Hercules participated in various adventures and became a god after his mortal death. 